Hey, 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 hey. Welcome back to the Faux Brits Show. I'm here today. My name is E, and I'm here today with... Snacks. Hit him. Hit him. My name's Snacks. Snacks I do this thing. I do this podcast thing. What's up, yo? What's good? We finally... Yo, why... I'm ready. We finally won. We won. I'm ready. No, listen. That was like the best case scenario. Like, you picture like, all right... Like, what's the best way this game could go and, like, everything? Like, what's the best way this could all happen? And that was literally the best that, that like, be, 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 the best that could have happened. Tell me I'm wrong. Tell me I'm wrong. Am I wrong? You're not wrong. You are not wrong. I wouldn't, I would be lying to you if I said you were wrong. You'd be lying. Um, we did say 4 1. You, we you know did. what's funny is we said 4 you said, 1. You said, you're like, oh, I wouldn't be mad if Van Persie scored. I was just like, oh, if we're winning 4 4 0 and then he scores, like, at the end, Mad like Ting, towards the end, Mad Ting. Mad that was Ting. that's what I'm saying. Best case scenario. Um, where do we even start? All right, let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Pogba, Pogba has to be the first topic of conversation. Pogba, coming what's up? You know what? He was man, man. Ah, give me ah, one. Give me one. Ah, that's, that's that's good. Woo! Man. I was literally at work, and I'm a tutor, so I have to be quiet when I'm working, and I have but, to, you know. But were you quiet? Uh, but, were you? but 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 United is life. The so, Fulbright show is life. Top red so I was points. watching the game, yeah. Top red points. And I turned it on. So I was driving back from class to get to work, and I turned it on about a minute or two before Pogba scored his like his screamer, his second goal. And I'm just chilling, post it up. Post it up. He scores this rocket. Like, great bit of play. Like, Rooney plays it to Lingard. Lingard lays it Lingard off to Pogba. Lays Pogba. it off. Ah! Lays it off, and Pogba just goes and... Mm, that was good. Yeah, yeah, that was nice. Bang! I want this. He that wanted the nice. goal. Listen, you know, this is it. This is like this is he the performance. Here. He needed this performance. He really, yeah, yeah. he like, like he scored his goal against Leicester and he played okay. But like this is the first game since we where signed him where he dominated. Where he He's bossed done. it. Yeah, he was a don. He bossed it. Um, yeah. Our midfield, absolute flames. We were out here. Um, that whole you lineup. Know, that was a great lineup for this game. You know what I'm saying? Like considering the circumstances. Uh, I was really happy. I was really, Waza was in there. This is this, these are the type of games he should play. These are the games. Uh, I, I don't think Waza should ever play, but I mean, yeah. yeah. Cheeky Europa League here and there. Um, Mata, I thought was Mata was class, mate. He was he was silk. He was nice. Mata was nice. That was our best performance, I think, of the season. Lingard was nice. <sighs> Martial, Martial was, was like key. low key back. Is he low key back? Like low key. Martial. Yeah, like low key, very low key back. I think he's one banger goal away. I mean, he did score a banger goal against Stoke, but like he took that penalty well too, and he was the one who drew the foul. He's so the yeah, one who drew it. Yeah, that would have been a goal. That one would have been a goal if he didn't get fouled yeah. because his exactly, body, exactly. he was there. Like, literally, all he had to do was hold RB and click, and then like bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No like way. even though I hate Wayne Rooney, he had a nice layoff to Lingard. Like he played the he ball. Had a nice game. No, he had a really nice game. Like in general, oh, he did. relax, relax. He wasn't that good. I mean, like w- w- was it Lingard's? Goal. No, Pogba's goal. Which goal no, it was, was it? Linga, it was Pogba's goal where he basically set the play up. Like, good for him. But the thing but is, But it was right? the second goal where he laid it off to Lingard and Lingard shot it. Pogba's goal, he picked up the ball. Lingard was pointing. He was like, through ball, through ball. And Rooney, like, within the most abysmal pass in the world, made that pass. And I was like, sick, it's halftime, whatever. And then the goalkeeper, someone missed. What, they, like, gave the ball away. And then we, Rooney picks it up again. That was nice. That was nice. Good hustle on his part. He needed it. He needed it. He needed it. Um, standout. Another standout uh, performance. Michael Carrick. Bro, <sighs> have God. I not been saying for like weeks that he needs to start? Michael Carrick, bro. D block. That guy is class. That guy is class. Literally controlled the midfield. Like. That Mata, like, ball that he played to Mata, that Mata got fouled on for the penalty. Have you seen us play a ball like that all season? Like, a through ball, but, like, it's just so direct and so, like, about it. Like, I love Michael Carrick, bro. Not as of late. We yeah. haven't, I haven't seen it. We you don't know do that. I... We don't. Nobody does that. Nobody. And, like, people, some people try to, but nobody pulls it off. And, like. Yeah, no. Michael Carrick, man. And Michael you know Carrick, I, I I tweeted today. Michael Carrick, like whenever he he's played this season, he's been he's been good. He hasn't been bad. And I was uh, he deserves a league start. Like he, he he's not gonna get it. Don't get me wrong. He won't get the start, but he deserves one. That's the thing. I was really ripped that he wasn't subbed off because 
he wasn't subbed off, which means he's not going to play Sunday. Like, maybe he'll come off the bench, but, like, the fact that he played all 90 minutes means he's, you know, he's... What did you think of Zlatan not starting? I liked it. I liked it. Like, he needed a break, um, mix it up a bit. No, I liked it. Uh, it was a do good you, decision. Do you think he should start against Chelsea? So I know I know you. I know you. You're like, you don't like, you don't like the Zlatan type of player where you're a big body. You like quicker guys. I understand that. Does Zlatan, like, should he start next game after this performance? Does he, yeah. He start? Yeah, I still have him starting for Chelsea. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, I Cause, think- no, because you know what it was? Is Yeah, it's because, like, we've had off, like, me and you, we've had conversations off the pod, and you've off ripped Zlatan. You've ripped him. You've, you've ripped him. That's true. Like, you've, you've no, torn that's, him. Not, that's not a lie. So I was literally fully prepared by like, coming in with you saying, look what happens when we don't have Zlatan starting, no, this, that, thing, thing, that. It was Fenerbahce. Like, Low key, yeah. but, okay, but we lost to Feyenoord. I know, but, like, don't we get We barely beat Zoria. Mate, you know what's funny is Fenerbahce is the only club in this group that I knew of, like, I knew about because of Van Persie, and they had Nani. They signed Martin Skirtle from Liverpool, who's shit. But it's funny is that, like, the most known team, we bodied, like, the heaviest. Yeah, no, and, like, you're forgetting, like, we were at home, you know what I mean? We we just played on Monday. Like, I don't know. I think everything was in our favor, like, momentum and, like, all, you know what I'm saying? No, and, I feel, I feel, and, um, no, I, I think this was our best performance of the season. I think, Definitely honestly, does. if there was <sighs> one player that, like, realistically made his way, like, into the starting lineup and, like, has to play, it would be if it was two players, it would be Mato and Lingard. And they just showed that they have to play. Like, they belong in this team starting lineup. Like, Specifically Mata. Like, like Mata. we were talking last game, the game goes too fast for... When Mata plays, Pogba is good. Yeah, yeah. yeah. When Mata doesn't play, Pogba's not good. Yeah. Don't get me wrong, Pogba is a game changer. He mm-hmm. is. Like, he can... He's a superstar. Like, I've said this a bazillion times. But Mata's if nice. you surround him with a Fellaini... If you surround him with a Fellaini who... No, no offense to Fellaini, my man's. If you surround him with Fellaini, who isn't exactly the best offensive player, you can't rely solely be, like him, based solely like Pogba on offense. Yeah. Herrera is also very smart offensively, but he's playing holding midfielder. He can't go up too high. No, so for, no, Pogba, yeah. for 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 me right now to to make him like into because he's still getting better to make him into the, like the complete player that we bought that we like we bought planning for the future. Mata needs to start. It's just sure. simple. No, for sure, for sure. Mata needs to start. And, like, Lingard on the right, too. Like, who else are you going to play on the right? Like, we keep throwing people on the right, and, like, does anyone do better than Lingard on the right? Who? Who? You know what for I mean? For me, for me. No, no, no. I, I love Lingard. Like, I love Lingard. Like, Lingard on the I've right. loved him since he scored the goal against West Brom. Like, we know we know what we're going to get from Lingard. He's not a superstar, but we know we he's, he's good he enough. He won't let you down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He doesn't let you down. He does his job, like, very well on the right. For sure, for sure, for sure. But, like, like it's like it's weird because he's trying to, like, experiment there, and then he's just like, all right, I'm going to turn to Lingard for this reason. And it's just like, bro, like, what do you need to start Lingard? Like, just play Lingard, him. Just play like, him. Lingard for me, should start against Chelsea. He should yeah, start. Oh, absolutely, absolutely. Lingard. I think, I think, honestly, besides Rooney and Zlatan, you swap that. Carrick obviously can't start. Herrera. Herrera. Yeah. But other than that, I think and Darmian drop Darmian for Valencia. Uh, yeah. Valencia. You start the same lineup. One more you're forgetting. Smalling. He's oh he needs to get dropped. Do you remember uh, first half the ball is like in our half basically it's like yeah, yeah, maybe yeah. like ten yards into our half and he like crosses it back to David. Oh yeah, what's he doing? What was that? Mourinho was ripped too and like. Like he was in our he got own... subbed off at half. He got subbed off at half. That was yo. That was embarrassing. That was proper. Like what? Like and what you are you doing with last your life? Episode, you literally said he needs to get dropped. I, he, he does. He does. Like he's not cutting it. He's just really not cutting it for me. I mean, like Rojo played center back in the second half. I thought he was good. I thought he was really good. And you know, like I tell you this, like Rojo's not a left back for me. For me, in my opinion, in my opinion, he's a center back, and. He did really good. I think I thought he did really good. There was like he had he had a lot of moments where he had to use his pace, and did really good. Liked it. Smalling though, D block. What are you doing? Like, yeah. No, I think he's. I 
like for me, Chris Mong was our best center back last year, but that sure, doesn't sure, say sure. much considering that Daly Blend's first year as center back. Yeah, yeah, no, and Daly Blend, like, so for Chelsea, do you want to just talk about Chelsea lineups? Yeah, because I gotta, I gotta go soon. I have, I have the midnight release for Battlefield. All right. Um, it sucks. But all okay, right, let's. Like uh, you said, no, like you said, Rooney for Zlatan, Herrera for Carrick, and. Valencia for Darmian. Valencia for Darmian, and I would. And I would even, I would even say Daily Blend or Marcos Rojo for Smalling. Yeah, that's my lineup. Simple, plain and simple, easy, light work. Yeah. And like, well, you know what? You know what's funny? You know what's funny? Tell is me what every you know. after every game, whether we've won or lost, yeah. Whether we've won or lost, I've gotten a message saying Pogba's been shit. Pogba's been shit. Who? Ev- Mateus, Abdu, Tysir. Tysir tweeted at me. Tysir literally tweeted at me. And today, he literally tweeted at me and he said, oh, how did he do this game? Because I was talking that day. I was talking. I was tweeting. Like I sent about a bunch of tweets. I'm like, people don't rate Pogba yeah. because he doesn't score 40 goals a game. But you have to remember, he's like a six. He's an eight. Yeah, he's not yeah. supposed to score 40. Yeah, that's not his job. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, for sure. And I was just like, but no one looks at how he plays. People just look at the numbers. Absolutely. That day, he happened to be like extremely bad. Like that was probably his worst performance. I think it was against Feyenoord where we played really bad. And Tysir tweeted at me, and he says, "Oh, was he good today, bro?" Like right now, I'm just a shot. Sh- whatever you want to say. Like to all you scumbags. Like all this specifically, specifically to Mateus. Like Mateus, my homie. Like in my heart, like I love this kid. But the other but. day, he texted me. I'm in traffic, and he goes, "United stink. This, that, this, that. A bunch of stuff." Then um, what do you got for them now, though? What, what is it? What is it? Then today he says in our group chat, he goes, he goes, um, my friend of dude goes, oh look at this video, and he goes, can't watching Roma. This is a shot to him, like bro, you had time to watch the video. Roma aren't relevant. They tied three three to who? Like people like that. Like I just, I just don't, I, I, I don't, I don't like, I don't know why you have something against Manchester United. I don't know why, but like just, just rate them, just rate Pogba, rate us. Like we, we deserve it. Sorry. No, no, no. Just one thing though. It's fine. It's Fenerbahce. Like we know Fenerbahce are trash, but we're just happy that we wreck them, right? Like facts. Like, right? Hey, they're top. They're one of the top teams in the Turkish league, which is which is like, fair. but like, it's okay. Yeah, no, no, no. Okay, yeah, no, you're definitely right. But like, I knew we were gonna trash. Like, we both knew we were gonna trash them. Like, I don't, I don't know. I didn't have high hopes for them, so I'm gassed. I'm obviously gassed, but I'm like, gassed. But like. Yeah, it's it's, it's fun about you. It's light work. We got this. Like it's nothing. We needed it now, but we needed no. We needed a win, especially we needed, going. We Chelsea. needed a win playing well, which was that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, for sure. It's. Uh, I wish he took him off. Took Carrick off at like the 65th. Yeah, 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 yeah for sure. Like for 70th sure. minute because Michael Carrick for me is like you have to drop someone. You can't drop Pogba after two goals like that. Those were two well taken goals. No, no, perfect no. penalty, and then me. Like I said in the SoundCloud, link will be in the description. Pogba takes like an absurd amount of outside the box shots. I said it's just a matter of time until he scores one. Today was his first one. One time, places it to the left, lovely, like very lovely, yeah. And me, like we know Pogba, like he he can take the ball and wiggle and get by. But there's sometimes even when he's doing that, he doesn't look confident. Today, like on the ball, like ten out of think, ten, ten out of ten for me. Do you think that daily blend? Can play the Michael Carrick role in midfield. Yes, right. That's, I think that that's too. What he is? That's what he that's is. That's what though. he is. That's what he is. That's what he is. Yeah, yeah. I mean, like, we've so just been back ca- nonsense. No, no, no. That's yeah, yeah. I was thinking about that today as I was watching the game. I was like, wow, like it'd be cool if we had like another Michael Carrick that we could just put in. And then I was like, pause, pause. Daily Blind is literally another Michael Carrick we can just put in. Um, yeah. Um, score for prediction. Me, we, for me. This whole center back, I think we've just gotten, before I get to that, before yeah. um, this whole daily blend of center back nonsense, we're just used to it, so we just kind of assume. But for me, he's still a center midfielder. Yeah, yeah, yeah. he's a Michael Carrick. He's a, he's, yeah, like, he's, he's literally the heir to Michael Carrick. I think yeah. that's why we sound. But anyways, my score prediction for Chelsea, I think we're going to destroy What did you say? Them. Wait, what did you say last time? Said I said 1-0. Yeah. I said 1-0. I think we're going to beat them. But I said, we're only, we're either going to draw or beat them, but we haven't been scoring goals, so we... Like, I'm going to say 1-0. But now, coming off a victory, and they barely won their last game. And you're gassed. And I'm gassed. Like, mm-hmm. emotions are running high and all this this ish. Yeah. I think we're going to beat them 3-0. Deep I think we're going to ruin them. Like, 
That's, yeah, yeah. We're, gonna dest- we're gonna wreck them. It's gonna be crazy. Yeah. I think Pogba's gonna score another. I think this is like this is Pogba's time now. I think Pogba's gonna score another. Okay, don't jinx us, but I. I think Mata's gonna score. And depending, wait, 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 hold on a second, mate. You said the same lineup, right? No Rashford, I know. That's what I was gonna say, yeah, bro. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's wild. Yeah, yeah. I mean, but don't get it twisted. Rashford's still the truth. Don't Rashford get it twisted. Is still the truth. Don't, don't get it twisted. Don't ever, don't ever get it twisted. Don't be scum. Don't be scum. No, no, I mean, scum. I mean, if he's if Martial, honestly, it's one of those things where if Martial starts on the left or Rashford starts on the left, like they're both boys. You know what I mean? So like, as long as one of them is playing, like absolutely without a shadow of a doubt, we're good. Yeah. But, we didn't even talk about Lingard's goal. That was crazy. That was nice. That was clean. That was, that was clean. That was yeah, yeah. yeah, that was a nice. Yeah, I was just like, I was like, oh, Lingard, what are you doing, bro? He takes no, the shot. That was clean. That was good. But like the thing is, is like Lingard doesn't shoot from outside the box, so like I don't expect him to score those. You know what I mean? Yeah, again, yeah. I like him. Yeah. I like Lingard, bro. I really. Oh, like I him. love Lingard. Yeah, yeah. All right, I'm gonna be doing a Twitter poll. I just picked up a United before I finish. Um, a United jersey. I just picked it up at Adidas. Shout out to Adidas. Um. And I'm going to put four names, and I'm going to run a poll to see what name I get on the back of it because, you know, e, e Block, you know me. I have – I'm very indecisive when it comes to jersey names. You'll so I'm going to let P- – I'm going to let my 185 followers on Twitter decide for me. All right. Word, word. I'll vote too. Yeah. Yeah. It, it, it's gonna be funny so, yeah, definitely hit that vote. What's going to be funny vote. is these people don't know you, and they don't realize that you're still going to change your mind. And this vote no, is- no, no, no. <laughs> I'm, no, I'm going to hold it. I'm going to put – I'm going to put four players yeah. that I like. Yeah, I promise. Like right. this, like on right now, on the pod, I'm doing it. Right. I will do whatever Yo, this, they. This is the faux Brits, bro. We don't, we don't make promises we don't keep. You get me? This you're is making this. a promise right now. You better be ready. All right. Um. But yeah. So yeah, I said Pogba. I said Mata. And then for my third goal, I'm gonna go Martial. Martial on off like a header or something. But yeah, you go. Your score prediction. I said three one last episode, right? I think. Yeah, you said we we're gonna smash them. Yeah, I'm gonna stick. I'm gonna stick to exactly what I said. Um, nothing's really changed for me. Um, I think I said Zlatan one, mm-hmm. Herrera one, and I'm okay. gonna say Zlatan two, Herrera one. Zlatan needs me. You know me on this number yeah, yeah, four. Yeah. Like, like he scored four goals. Like Falcao did, Di Maria did, Phil Jones. Where's number four? Like, yeah. Now say no more. Say no more. So he he needs if he if he gets a goal then I'm not worried that he's gonna bang in goals left and right he just needs to get over the hump right now like he needs one bad. Um, shout outs only like only two shout outs today only two shout outs go Ray obviously I'm never not gonna shout out Ray on the show unless he pisses me off one day shout out to the homie Ray obviously yeah, you get one more. Oh boy, can you do your shout outs in between? Oh. Uh... I'm gonna give I'm gonna give Lou a cheeky shout out. I'm gonna give Lou a cheeky shout out. Yeah, he he commented on the podcast. Commented. He said my uh, my audio was really good, so I'm gonna give him a cheeky shout. out. And then mine was trash. Yeah, I don't know what happened last episode. Sorry, mate. Apologies. Sorry, sorry, lads. Sorry, sorry. Apologies. You got one more. Go. Uh, I'm gonna shout out Mateus because I destroyed him. I destroyed Roma. Okay. I apologize. Well, I don't really apologize for that. Everything I say, I mean. Your most relevant player is forty, but I. Shout out to you. I know you're a good sport. You're a good lad. And I know you're going to, we're just going to get over the hump. All right. So shout outs to you. Is that it? Should I play the song? You have to, you have to shout someone. You have two shout outs. Oh yeah. Yeah. I have one more shout out. D block. <sighs> shout out man United. Big ups man United. Yeah, big up us. Big up big us. us up. Big Come up, on big bro. Up big we up finally up. won. Yeah, I feel sure. exactly like Craig and Hack. Yeah, you, no, you're I feel right. like that after they beat Man City. Cause I just watched that episode of Filthy Files again yesterday. Yeah. So I feel like I'm gassed. I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm yeah. huge. Oh, yeah. Like, ah, I'm, I'm huge. I'm right? I'm I want this. I want to win. I love winning. So, yeah. Um, oh, nice. wow. I have to go one in the morning. All right. Awesome. All right. All right, bruv. I want to start bouncing. Peace. Peace.